We are learning more about tonight about that 17 year old boy killed during an Aurora Juneteenth celebration. Xavier Sturgis had just finished his junior year in high school. And tonight people gather to remember him and call for an end to youth violence. Number 7's Lance Hernandez is live in Aurora and Lance, you reached out to family members? I did. They're still in a world of hurt. Didn't want to talk on camera today. Still trying to come to grips with what happened here in Rocky Ridge Park. There is somebody shot. A neighbor shared this cell phone video, which shows park visitors scrambling as more gunshots ring out. The young victim, identified by family and friends as Xavier Sturgis. The 17 year old went to Eagle Crest High School and was about to begin his senior year. The family shared this tribute video and said Xavier loved spending time with his six siblings, cousins, and extended family. With you, there is peace. Lord, let your peace come and let people be reconciled to each other, brother to brother, sister to sister. Tonight, a small group gathered at the Martin Luther King statue in Denver City Park to pray for peace. The word on the street that the gunman was younger than the victim. I hate it that that young man lost his life. But the question becomes, what was a 16 year old kid doing with a gun? We asked Aurora police if the gunman is 16 and whether an arrest has been made. A spokeswoman said there has been no arrest and no more information is being released. By At City Park, Nathaniel Trotter led this small group in a song he wrote to honor the victim. He was moved to write it after seeing two weeks of Black Lives Matter marches. Simple celebration, 1,000 having a good time, Ball of tickets one to mess things up. Facebook filled with messages of condolence to Xavier's family. Now, police told us on Friday that they believe this was an isolated incident between two individuals and that the suspect or suspects posed no threat to anyone else. Again, no arrests yet. Lance Hernandez, Denver 7.